Hello, welcome back to a new series. Um, yeah, so I know it's pretty crazy for you to think. I bet you're all wondering what the hell's going on, especially if you put the little the little bell on to get my notifications. Um, so I've did, I've had a bit of free time, so I thought I'd make some tutorials. Um, I've just got finished doing another tutorial um, on. Um, making a backup a, a directory backup application i'll link to that um at the top um if i can remember to <laughs> um but yeah so in this tutorial series we're going to be creating um a password management system or a password management application using wpf and um c sharp uh the reason why I've chose to do this because you'll learn <clears throat> different things, how to encrypt, how to decrypt, how to um, work with lists, how to work with um, retrieving and um, entering um, data from a into a database and from a database. Uh, we're going to be using a local database um, and we'll speak a bit more about that later on um, in the coming tutorials. I'm not sure how many there's going to be yet. Uh, but I'm going to try and make them around about the 30 minute mark in each. Um, but, you know, it might go over, it might, might be just under, just depending um, what we're up to. Anyway, that's beside the point. So, yeah, um, this this little part, I'm just going to be going over um, the, um, what the what I want the application to look like or a, a, something similar. Uh, to what I'm going to be showing you, uh, it might not be 100% exactly the same, but like I, I do sometimes change my mind when I'm actually looking at the application um, head on. So, um, so this screen here, as you can see, this is the login screen. So when we load up that application, this is going to be what we're greeted with. Um, it's uh, I've named it Safe Key. Um, we've got a username, password box, and just a, a, an unlock button. Uh, it's, that's, that's pretty much it really um, it's going to be a dark style because that seems to be the thing at the moment everyone seems to be really into the dark um, the dark modes uh, as as am I mostly um, and then we're going to come over to the actual design of the application again now I've seen it a few times I'm starting to think uh, I don't really like that I don't really like that um, I'm not really enjoying this border um, the color is too bright up there um yeah, so uh, like i say I, I do change my mind quite often um but yeah the again the colors might change the the general layout is going to be pretty much like this um but yeah it's it, it don't don't be like disheartened if i do change my mind on exact layout type things because I do do it quite often. So uh, here we've got the list of our credentials. So we've got Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest. You've got a filter search here so you can search for whatever you need. We've got add remove um, and when you click on one of these um, list items then we will get the credentials to pop up here. Uh, we've got a little icon for the list. Um, we've got username password link and email um, and we've got our edit buttons um, we've got our edit buttons and we've got a button here that will take us to that link um, and we can copy them for quick access so we can just click that and it'll copy that to our clipboard and then we can go onto the site I'm, f I'm very much aware that <laughs> Password uh, management, uh, they, they, they're kind of obsolete now, aren't they? I mean, we've got web browsers that save our credentials, um, so we don't really need to use them. But sometimes you want to have a local one, or maybe you're just you're just watching this so you can you, you can learn how to make one. Um, it's all it's all good education, like you'll even learning how to put uh, put them into a database and stuff. I've noticed that there is actually some things that are missing. I've missed an update button at the bottom, but it's not, not much to worry about there. Let's just move these along a bit, actually, because it's it's actually annoying me. 
there we go um <clears throat> yeah so like i said it, like this might not be the end design um but that, well that's it for this part i know it were only a really quick part i just wanted to give a quick overview of what what this um this series is going to be about and if you you want to stick around then you can do um so if you have any suggestions on anything else that you'd like to see in this application you can you're more than welcome to add them to the comment section and i'll i'll take on board anything that i see that's interesting um great so if you, this does interest you give th give it a thumbs up um it means a lot um if you've got any suggestions leave them in a comment subscribe to the channel if you haven't already um and the more the more that i know that people are interested in something the 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 quicker i will be at getting out videos because i don't want to let people down uh but if there's only like if there's only 10 or 12 people that are interested i know that um that's quite a few people but it's you know on the on the grand scale of thing, things it, i i take up quite a lot of time making these videos and then edit well i don't really do much editing afterwards i'll be honest um but i would but anyway I'm, I'm going off on a tangent doesn't matter um but yeah if you want to see um some more videos uh subscribe and click the bell uh, to be notified when i post i don't um i don't spam so you you, you know Okay, so anyway, see, see you in the next video, guys. Bye.